third episode of the uh, series on errors to avoid and how to become a better investor is about uh, transaction cost. So basically what is a transaction cost? Is uh, It's made by two things. A fixed amount that I have to pay to my broker when I buy a stock. For example, Interactive Broker is charging me four dollars when I buy European stocks and when I sell a stock. Interactive Broker charges me four dollars again when I sell a stock. So if I want to put, uh, if for example, I have one thousand dollars to invest in a month and I want to buy five stocks and I want to buy European stock, I put uh, 200 stocks into every transaction. I get charged uh, $4 out of 200 euros. It's almost uh, 2% to buy it, and then I want to sell it, I get charged another 2%. It's minus 4%. The market, on average, per year, does uh, 5-6%. If I spend 4% out of 6%, assuming the stock will do as the market, to do in and out, uh, I am really, really, really penalized. So we need to be very careful to do in and out and look what is the transaction cost. Another part is the spread. The spread is the difference between buy, uh, ask price and bid price. That can be a lot for small stocks, especially if we buy in those days when markets are illiquid. We need to be very, very careful about this spread. That is the difference uh, between the market price and the, mar and the price we are able to buy a stock at. If we put those costs together that we don't even realize, we risk to strongly underperform the market. Thank you guys, please give me a like button if you enjoy the video.